Hello everyone, welcome to App Unbox. Today we are going to introduce you to a very popular keyword research tool which is called the Keyword Tool Dominator. So let's dive into the video and get started to introduce you to the Keyword Tool Dominator. All right guys, so let's open our web browser. All right, in our web browser we are going to search for Keyword Tool Dominator. All right, we have that. All right, we're gonna go into the first website here. So this is the Keyword Tool Dominator's official website. We're gonna sign up for free, username. All right, so after inputting all of the information here, we're gonna click create free account. We're gonna say password, okay. So they have mailed us an activation email to our email address. So let's go ahead and go to our Gmail account. As you can see guys, we have Keyword Tool Dominator account activation email here. Now we're gonna click on the activation link. We're gonna click sign in. We're gonna enter the username and password that we have set and click on sign in. You can also add an extension for your web browser from the Chrome App Store. It's, all, it's available in Google Chrome and Edge at the moment. Firefox, Opera, and Safari is not supported. So we're just gonna close this window because we're not adding the extension at the moment. So as you can see guys, we have the Keyword Tool Dominator's entire interface here. And as you can see, we can research keywords for Amazon, Bing, eBay, Etsy, Google Keyword Tool, Google Shopping Keyword Tool, Home Depot Keyword Tool, Walmart Keyword Tool, YouTube Keyword Tool. Well, this is gonna be really helpful for your SEO guys, so you can research for a lot of keywords if you want. All right, so I'm gonna start with Google because that's the most popular search engine, right? So going in Google, and now I'm gonna search for a very popular term, iPhone 13 Pro Max screen repair. All right, so Keyword Tool Dominator extension needs to be installed in Google Chrome. Okay, so, all right, we have, since we don't have any choice, so we're gonna install the Keyword Tool Dominator uh, extension from the Chrome Web Store. Keyword Tool Dominator. As you can see, guys, we have installed the Keyword Tool Dominator, and now we're gonna pin it right here. So let's go ahead and close this tab, and also close this tab. Okay, let's close this tab too, and then we have the Keyword Tool Dominator ready here. As you can see in this tab, Keyword Tool Dominator has access to this site. Or we can just close. Yeah, Keyword Tool Dominator does not have access to this site's data. All right, let's see if it has access to YouTube data or not. As you can see, it doesn't have access to YouTube data, so the extension is only for using it in the website. So here we are in the website, and now we're going to search for a keyword. All right, as you can see, I have installed the extension, but it's not working, so we are gonna refresh this page and retry. And as you can see, guys, it's working, and the keywords are being searched. Lots of keywords are being found, I can see. So as you can see, guys, if you are searching for a very popular keyword, then lots of keywords are gonna pop up. As you can see, they have already found 83 keywords found for me, so it's a really popular keyword. And now I'm gonna also search a non-popular keyword and find out what happens. All right, guys, as you can see, the tool have found so many keywords for us. Oh, wow, so many keywords have been lined up and you can use the keywords as you want. Back of phone repair, so they're just meaning the back shell, okay? Now the fun part is that you can also download the selected keyword in CSV format. Now let's see that how our downloaded format works in Microsoft Excel. So as you can see guys, the entire keywords that we have generated earlier is now in this Excel sheet, which is a really a cool thing that you can download and keep your data and you don't have to research them from the website to get those data again. Now we have multiple download options here. Now let's check out the other download options, what happens. So we have keyword CSV. Well, this is comma separated values. Well, this is almost the same. Now let's go ahead and try the other one. CSV for Excel. I don't I don't see any major difference and we have .tsv file tab preparated values and uh, wow, I don't have any extension to open this file. So I'm just going to keep it that way or maybe I can try Notepad, let's see. All right, you can also use TSV and uh, open it with Notepad. All right, so we have tried Google Keyword Tools. Now let's go ahead and try something else. Now going to Keyword Tool Dominator, and then we are gonna try YouTube Keyword Tool because 
YouTube is the most popular video streaming platform, all right? So let's go ahead and search for something. All right, so now I'm gonna search for a non-popular keyword that uh, pops up in my head. So I'm gonna search for you green charger. All right, so I'm gonna search for you green GAN 65 watt charger. Now let's see what keywords pop up for us. Well, I guess this keyword is not so much unpopular as if so many keywords are being found. All right, guys, so now we have 138 keywords. I think it's more popular than the previous one I've searched. Well, I was searching for an unpopular one, but I've got more popular. As you can see, it has also filtered down the keywords because I saw you green 65 watt GAN charger two port here, but now it's gone. So I think they have filtered for us, but still you need to filter more keywords and get the exact ones that you are looking for. As you can see, this one, uh, Ugreen GA and 65 watt charger, 0 watt. Well, who wants 0 watt, man? Come on. So we're going to filter out these keywords because these are unnecessary totally. Or we can just download all of these keywords in our CSV file. And then we can filter it out from Microsoft Excel. As you can see, we have downloaded it. And now we're going to open it and see if everything's OK. All right, so we have 138 keywords, guys, and we can uh, just remove the keywords that are irrelevant to our topic. All right, guys, so we are done with YouTube Keyword Tool. Now I'm gonna go ahead and search for Amazon Keyword Tool. Now let's go ahead and find some Amazon keywords. Precise, broad, normal. Okay, all right, I'm gonna just, uh, it's highly recommended that for beginner users, a normal edge selected. All right, now let's go ahead and select here, MacBook Pro M2. All right, now the tool is gathering keywords for MacBook Pro M2. All right, guys, as you can see, we have 188 keywords now. Well, I guess I'm just searching for more popular keywords and more popular keywords. All right, so we have all of these keywords for Amazon here, and we can just download keywords by word frequency. Hmm, I wonder what this does. Let's see. But as you can see, Pro was used 198 times. All right, so we're not going to use this. We're just going to download the selected keywords and move on to the next part. Now let's go ahead and search for something new like Walmart keyword tool. Now we're going to search for Mac Pro because I'm pretty sure Mac Pro is not being used uh, very often and people don't buy Mac Pro too much. So this should be an unpopular keyword, right? Now let's go ahead and check out. I think I stand corrected. Mac Pro M2 is not used too much in households. As you can see, less keywords are being found. All right, guys, as you can see, we have seven keywords found for Mac Pro M2, and which is really amazing because Mac Pro M2 is not that much popular. And still we have seven keywords and I'm just gonna download it for later use then. So as you can see, guys, you can use this keyword tool and since I'm using the free version you can also use the free version in this keyword tool you will have five to ten searches daily uh, you can't search more than five to ten times daily with this keyword tool and you can search a lot of platforms with this keyword tool such as Amazon, Bing, eBay, Etsy, Google keyword tool, Google Shopping, Home Depot, Walmart and YouTube. So guys if you feel that this keyword tool is a helpful product then please share it with someone else who will be helped with this video. Until we meet again next time, stay safe and take care.